All right, class, this video shows how to make your own Google site. And we actually have a template for you guys to start making your online portfolios. So let's get started. You're gonna actually go to google.com and type in Google Sites. And the first link that pops up, you're actually going to click on. So go ahead and click on it. And you're gonna definitely need to have uh, your war your Google email created by this point so I already created mine so you should get a screen like this pop up and then go ahead and log in to your Google site and then hit sign in and you're going to get this main page and what we want to do is we want to create an ePortfolio site. And so what you're gonna do is you're gonna hit the Create button. And I'm gonna scroll up. And it's gonna ask you to select a template to use. And we've already created a template for you to use. So you're gonna hit Browse the Gallery for more. And what I want you to do is I want you to select a site template. And you're actually gonna type in WTHS Art Department. And you'll notice that WTHS Art Department Portfolio will be the only one that shows up. And make sure it says Warren Township High School Art Department. So you're going to click on that. And what we want to do is we want to preview template. I'm going to click Preview Template. And this is the template that we want you to use for your portfolio. So when you get to this page, you want to hit Use Template. And then you're going to have to name your site, okay? So make sure it says WTHS Art Department Portfolio in red. That's the template that we're using. And you're going to name your site. So you're going to name your site your actual name. So I'm going to name mine, my, my actual name. Scroll down. And this is your actual URL that you're going to have to give your teacher at the end of the semester so they know where to find your work, okay? So you're going to select that go down. It's going to ask you to type a code, so you're going to have to type whatever code it shows. And then you're going to hit create. So it looks like because I created one already, I'm going to make a new one. For you guys, it should work. And so now it's creating your site. take a couple minutes. When you get to this main page, what's going to happen is it's going to show your name and then it's going to show, it's going to say portfolio assessment and then it's going to say I'd add an intro to art. Now if you're not in those classes, you can change it. So there's a little pencil that says edit page and you also, you have to click on the actual page that you want to edit. So I want to edit the I'd add page because let's say I'm in ceramics and I'm going to click on the little pencil and I'm going to change it to ceramics and then hit save. Now before I hit save I want you to scroll through what's on the ceramics page. So what we're going to ask you to do for the semester is you're going to create an artist statement and you're going to post a photo of your work before you get started with the class or your first couple weeks of the class and then an after at the end of the semester and then for each project you're going to actually submit and write a project name and your teacher will go through this more in depth as we kind of go through the semester. So once you've changed the name you're going to hit save. okay? And you can make this as fancy as you want. If you're only in one art class then you can go ahead and hit edit page and you can obviously edit the ceramics page if you like okay so you know the name the date you can you know change the title 
So there's a lot of different options for you to pick. Colors, insert image. So that's kind of to get started to make your portfolio.